Hello, my name is Pavli Sabic, and we're here with Barrel Consulting and Tell Me More Ventures to interview our, to interview Troy Gungor from Vortex. Tell me, Vortex is, a, Vortex is a very interesting and niche player in the supply chain. Tell us exactly what you guys do. Yeah, so we're tracking uh, the seaborne energy market on a global level. So tracking everywhere from crude to refined products and gas on the water. Mm -hmm. um, it's very kind of important to know that market as it's, you know, around, you know, 99% of what price action happens in these commodity markets is happening on the water, even though it's only about 50% of the trade globally. Okay. So it's kind of a very big part of the market. Okay. And is it mainly commodities or other types of... Uh... It's mainly oh, what commodities. So we're tracking, you know, kind of crude, refined products, gases, and then as well as we're actually tracking the freight as well. So not just the cargoes, but then the freight as well. Fascinating. So that's a really interesting... Um set of data to look at yeah. these days, particularly with all the turmoil that's happening globally, geopolitically. Absolutely. What kind of interesting directional insights are you guys seeing that's happening right now? Yeah, absolutely. So we're seeing, you know, kind of reacting to the beginning of this year, kind of at the start of the Middle Eastern conflict. Um, we're seeing, you know, a lot of vessels rerouting around the Cape of Good Hope versus going through the Baba Mendev and the Suez Canals. You know, we're also heavily tracking kind of those Russian, Venezuelan and Iranian markets and kind of, you know, as they call them, the dark fleet. Mm -hmm. So kind of making sure that we stay on top of that and give our players, you know, again, all the Kind of actionable insights that they'll need in order to you know make proper trading decisions okay and so who are the typical um clients that you have and what are the typical use cases yeah absolutely so you know we have the the very physical commodity traders you know the large super major gas companies um financial institutions you know kind of the whole point of you know looking at the platform and kind of diving deeper into our data is you know, just kind of getting a better pulse check on the market and making sure that, you know, they're very up to date on what the information is. Mm -hmm. You know, they could do stuff from, you know, kind of look at vessel availability information, tracking, you know, ship to ship transfer activity, you know, kind of track tracking global flows in order to get a gauge on the macro, you know, economic markets, mm -hmm. you know, trying to trying to find their own signals in the data. And we're always finding new use cases right. for that as well. So it's the sky's the limit. 